time to lose. Wasser. Vermuten sie jetzt einfach mal, dass es Wasser ist, ne? Das heißt, die Tage so, okay. Ja, ist doch schon mal gut, Johannes. Nach morgen Wochenende, ne? Komm ich da durch? Hm, nö. Aber wohin willst du gehen? Vielleicht mal Richtung Kroko gehen sollen. Raus? Ah, dann nur da. Boah, das ist manchmal eine gute Frage, Claudia. Ist auch manchmal, dass der Körper einfach nur schwach ist, ne? Und dann vielleicht man Zug kriegt oder so. Und schon wird man krank. Mag. Ey, Nemo kann ich hoch. Okay, wir gehen in Richtung Kroko. Irgendwo da. Komm, da kommt jetzt mal zumindest ein Weg. So, Richtung Lager. Das ist aber noch ein Stück bis hier oben, ne? Ups. Boah, das ist bald am Ruckeln jetzt. Da kommen wir nicht weiter. Ah, 
<laughs> I could already see the camp. Over 400 meters in a straight line. I, I see you. Can you hear me? I can't get down from here. Oh. I can't get down this way. I could attach a rope though. But uh, for some reason I don't have one with me. Okay, haben wir hier so eine Art Baumenü oder sowas? Aber so geht's schon mal nicht. Kante auch nochmal da. Hier the ground slopes a little more gently, which doesn't mean it's completely flat. On second thoughts. Maybe not. <coughs> the last thing I need now is an injury. <laughs> hey, Claudia. Oh, damn it. I've been wandering around here too long. Looks like I'm going down after all. Nichts passiert, nichts kaputt gegangen. Alle Bein und Arm nur dran. Irgendwo da oben, ne? Ich dachte, ich jetzt halt rennen. Visibility could be better. nicht durch müssen. Naja. Closer to the camp. Find a place to land. I need to get back to Dragonfly as soon as possible. Go to the infirmary and do a full set of tests on myself. Krass. Da sieht man überhaupt nicht, wie weit wir gelaufen sind. in dem Buch nicht aufgenommen wurde, ne? Oh, 
mache ich Claudia. Steht zu weit weg dafür. So. So lässig, ne? Als ob das normal wäre. I remember you. Regis Third Satellite. Astrogator, sir. Crew? Dr. Gorski. Right on time. Any updates? We have a set of data from the near surface probe. <coughs> How's the activity? Zero, zero, and two. So, less than nothing. Atmosphere? Nitrogen, 78%. Argon, 2%. Carbon dioxide, zero. Methane, 4%. The rest is oxygen. But wait, that's 16%. With oxygen concentration as such, there should be life. At least some microbes. And yet we have detected no traces. Yeah, we'll get to that later. Let's finish with the probe we need <coughs> first. Air radioactivity? It's virtually zero. The word of paradise. No radioactivity, no endospores, no bacteria, no mold, no viruses, nothing. Just the oxygen. If there were no living organisms on the continent, there shouldn't be this much of it. What if life develops <coughs> on some other continents here? No, I doubt it. Insulation outside the equatorial zone is weak. You don't see how thick the polar ice caps are, don't you? I can guarantee a minimum of five miles of ice sheet, potentially six. Mm, that's true. There's more chance of something in the ocean. Some seaweed, algae. But why didn't life migrate to the land? Could be because of hard radiation. Mm, I don't think so. According to the probe readings, the ground activity is exceptionally low for this part of the galaxy. I wonder if some special kind of drought intolerant evolution occurred here. Sure. And that would at least explain some of the abnormalities. Hmm. Anyway, we'll have to take a look under the water. First, it would be good to know what time frame we're working with. Ready? Marit, do you have the geological analysis? Too early for mature conclusions, but this planet looks old to me. Such a fossilized egg must be at least six billion years old. Let's go, my film. Na gut. Any rare resources, forms, creatures? We can't expect such detailed data, sir. Not from this distance. Yes, we would have to explore the surface. Astrogator, what exactly are we looking for? The value of this planet. For now, it may seem like the pinnacle of nonsense. But I assure you that Regis 3 is not without worth. With all due respect, Astrogator, I have the impression you're not telling us everything. As always, Dr. Koval, your instincts are correct. Please forgive my reticence. My goal was to maintain unimpeded research neutrality. There is indeed a very important factor of interest in this planet. <coughs> the Alliance. The Alliance? Yeah. 